in the last few months. seed so close of course at the French Open up two sets to love against Novak for Fritz this would be a big big step up That first chip for the return was beautiful, but I would have loved to seen a couple of rips in the middle. Hey, Brad, what do you think? And the, the chips were getting floaty. That's a great return. I don't think tactically it's a bad play if you have a good slice. He's a, he's a rhythm player. He likes the ball in the pocket range. So if you can get the ball down a little bit, make him have to lift, uh, that's a good play. In her last match to Jessica Pagula, who will take on Ash Barty tomorrow. from the America and it was an even better backhand and finish from Tsitsipas, it's 2-1. And the serve, just stand back a little bit more and get that momentum moving forward. Because once the point has begun... Uh, we've talked a little bit about the gut that he's put in and the cross strings. I felt like the ball was flying on him. I felt like he didn't have that kind of ability to swing hard at, like he did at night in his first opening match. It's my sense. You? I agree. I definitely think the fact that it's a little heavier at night, not that same humidity. Beautifully played. There was some beautiful hands because there was nothing wrong with his chip and charge. I thought it was a nice chip, nice and deep. A good position at the net. That's just too good. It had height, but more importantly, it had enough pace as well that his opponent couldn't get back and track it. But it was just a little bit soft and gave Taylor time. And Taylor's very, very adept on that backhand side. If you give him a little bit of time, he can do just about anything. technique to finish off that point two at the net. Yeah, 
flip. He didn't care. He knew he was going to get a, code, a, a violation there for the, for the time. Uh, he, he didn't care at all. He wanted to take a little extra time, make sure he was really mentally prepared to play that break point. from Fritz. <laughs> yes! This is what we want. <laughs> We've got all the ingredients for a classic. Love it. Or if the fans weren't engaged, they are now. And he called the score. I mean, the, the, the shot clock is supposed to start once he calls the score. The players know that. So I, I wasn't really aware post those points when he called the score exactly. Normal or higher ball toss, but at the very top of the swing. And from a relatively small spread on his top does make it very hard to read from that standpoint. Some good high on that last forehand, Taylor Fritz. But you can see Taylor just introducing a bit more oh. elevation. That's crazy. Well, he's getting rushed at every department right now. Shot clock, Taylor's ground strokes. Taking too much time in the back of the court, obviously. was looking for crushes another forehand which has been the way that he's played so well in the last four to five months and Taylor Prince, Prince grabs a break 4-3 oh. Great pass from Sitz pass there, but the forehand prior to that, he had to dig to try and just put that ball back in play. Taylor absolutely lighting the ball up. With what's going on. That was heavy. Introducing us to one of the best shots in the men's the game at the moment, his forehand. And it closes out the opening set, 6-4. It's a little question in my mind about... What a pass. Set. I mean, he looked on his toes, moving really, really well to everything. And the second thing for me is that not possible. 
balls to the same spot. That's a clean strike. Early contact. I wonder if we'll see a few more there during the course of the evening because he's obviously on the warning already. He's already lost the first serve, but if you stand up to the line and throw the ball. I was thinking the same thing with the Jimmy Connors one. On to. And that second serve, like you said, Patch, I mean, he's, it's starting up there already and he's in such a great position to play that shot. Taylor Fritz has ever hit in his life. <laughs> <laughs> it's improv night. Watch Taylor here. He's going back to start with, thinking he's going to play a ground stroke. Then at the last minute, decides to come in. Look like Martha. Thirteen. Uh, Sam Gross down here sitting next to me, but it only got the chair next to him. I was expecting that from the first game, like heavy off forehands. Like Brad said, working the ball around, off forehand, then changing direction. And um, finally, I mean, the last couple of games looks like he's... San Diego, Patch. He's a pretty carefree kind of kid. That being said, I guarantee you. and what is the the time of this match is, is going perfectly in Fritz's favor he's not being run around it's he's got plenty of time to hit the ball he can pull the trigger when he wants he's not being rushed and in the last 10 years just a couple of Americans have reached the last four of a major Sam Query Wimbledon 2017 
2008. That second serve has worked beautifully for him. Well, that's an incredible turn of events, isn't it? Sitipas still isn't sure that the set. <laughs> I mean, that whole point was ridiculous, but I have to see this back end down the line in slow mo. Oh. Petch, I want to ask you about the backhand side. When you did that, that little study on the rotation and the spin that he's creating in the forehand, did you look at the backhand? Because the backhand seems to... What a game to captivate the fans here at Melbourne Park at the start of the third set. That was not an easy volley coming forward. Taylor did a pretty good job off the squash shot getting that down low. Pass. That's something that's improved and he moves well, but he definitely moves well better side to side than running forward, in my opinion. Bit of adversity to deal with. Three shots in that round. Come in and defend the net on Sissipas' terms that he taken the other ball on the forehand. through a little bit oh it's too good Game. but if you want it firm you know what I'm talking about Brad old school turn the shoulders punch it chip it the middle of the court at all there 13 part of that reason is why well, you just saw there 16 Ks look how hard he was hitting in the opening set that is monstrous from the American 
and he was so out. secure on it as well. So more opportunities, more time on the ball for Sitsipas now. You know, had opportunities to get to slam finals. <laughs> There was a degree of intensity amongst those guys as they started competing for majors against each other. And everybody's excited to see more of. Jensen Brooksby is <laughs> playing this week. The Columbus Challenger. Dude. Yeah, but I'm American. <laughs> Just have kept them all starred and still continue to follow them. I also do think that we have a couple of guys that, that are still playing at the challenger level that are on the edge of breaking in. Two, like three max, and then he's got to rip that beautiful back end of his step into it. Yeah, guys, we're all in agreement. I was going to say, I mean, uh, I have a play that I talk to players about. We call it slice and sting. You slice in order to get the other guy to lift the ball. And then... that short end. Oh, huge. Two in a row. Hung around, waited for his opportunity. Solid return, nothing spectacular. And it was a fairly Prince routine Paul shot for Sissipas, right. except for the pressure. Down break point, he cracks 4-3 to the American. Someone in the crowd shout, Andron. That's not Taylor Fritz's trademark. He does occasionally, and I have seen him in tournaments. going to take it down there at 40 love one of the rare backhands he has hit down the line and that was all a little too easy yeah, besides that one service game at 4-5 in the second set from Fritz it's been very very solid in the first set.
He's going to need another big serve to keep him at bay. defensive ability was only allowed because of his athleticism. the fourth seed hanging on by his fingernails here in the third so confident and he is has been all over the place in the in these matches hasn't he i yep. mean his pure athleticism beautiful striking of the ball zero hesitation Two sets to one, he leads. His pace, he looks really comfortable serving and opening this game up. turned up at the French, as I say, in a big hole, turned it around and obviously made the semis push Nova to five in the end. <laughs> nice turnaround. And then, of course, big Rafa here from two sets to love down. off balance a couple of times and I thought that Tsitsipas had the point but wow did he take it from defense to offense very quickly
throwing that one from the next gen out. Because <laughs> there's an exhibition. <laughs> I'm not quite sure why it's in you there. Don't think, you don't think sets the four count as a uh, <laughs> five set match? It's Tennis's Disney tournament. Serve there. He plays for the next however long he's on the tour. Yeah, what a great story he is as well. on show though from Sitsipas's perspective at the moment. You know, he was right next to him, I understand that, but they're wearing masks. One more of those, boom, you're gone. The, who's gone? The person from the, the yeah, player's the coach. Box? The coach is gone. And when you present it and... and
just the second break point of the match for Sitsipas. The stats that you showed how he's been playing more for he still believes in the backhand more. And cost him dearly. off of a five setter as well. That is a gutsy second serve to go to Fritz's forehand. Fast, 171 yeah. Ks. Set point. Amazing effort. Thirty love. a nice one. Front foot tennis from Fritz. Early in the sets, Fritz has been rock solid. Jumping at shadows. That was a, a smart first point. to the exclusive last eight club of the 2022 Australian Open men's draw. so far in his career deciding set breakers 9-1 just two losses if you take his entire career
How did Fritz find that lob? The final put away was accompanied by a symphony of applause and deservedly so. What a response, guys. Wow. Nothing on it whatsoever. It kept Taylor in the point. Needs to do a little better job of quieting down the crowd before the points start. This wasn't a bad chip, but this is just a really beautiful racket head work here. Making it look easy, but that was a tough shot. dominant service games of the match he's ahead 4-3 final set but so far neither man has put a foot wrong in this final set Oh, that's impressive. And both these guys have served so well on the big point. really solid and not give away any three points. Nervous, I mean, completely understandable. And also, was that the right side to come in on? It's been perpetual motion, but there was a stillness there. Can sets a pass, finish it. Oh, God, what a shot! Just fantastic moving by Fritz to get to this and then control it down the Unbelievable play by Fritz though.
come back with such courage on the next point that even it up at 15 all. Thank you. Match points.